Merry Christmas one and all. Good evening and welcome to the Cheshire League preview for matches to be played on the 27th of December. The first matchup is Congleton Vale in 6th, playing Rudheath Social in 13th. They played each other back on the 31st of August with Congleton running out 2-1 winners. In the last three games for each side, both have had in different form. Uh, Congleton last time out lost 2-0 uh, to Whaley Bridge in the JB Parker Cup semi-final. Rudd Heath lost 4-1 to Poynton. Congleton then had a District Cup match where they ran out 10-0 winners against Tarvin. Uh, Rudd Heath losing 4-2 to Altrincham Reserves. And then uh, the third game prior to, to today is 2-all, which was Congleton 2 against Greenalls, Padgates and Oswalds 2. Rudd Heath losing 1-0 to Style. 6th v 13th, predictions? Let's have your comments. Let's see what we think was going to be the score. Game two on Tuesday the 27th is Denton Town against Linotype at Cheadle Heath Nomads. It's 9th v 5th and they're yet to play each other. In fact, this is uh, the first half of the festive season double header. So Denton Town at home will play Linotype. Denton, they've lost the last four. Not the greatest of runs. They lost to Poynton 3-1. Malpas 1-0. And then in the quarterfinal of the Lancashire FA Amateur Shield, they lost to Blackpool Ren Rovers 7-0. Chile Heath Nomads, um, not a bad run at the moment. Um, last time out, they were winning 1 0 just after half time up at Garswood United before the fog came down, causing the game to be abandoned. They beat Malpas 1 0 last time before that. And more recently in the Cheshire Cup, they drew 2 2 before they ran out 4 3 winners on penalties. And they go on to play AFC Macclesfield in the new year in the quarter final of the Cheshire Amateur Cup. Match three of Tuesday the 27th sees Eagle Sports taking on points and that's 14th against 8th. Eagle Sports had an unusually slow start to the season, I think they lost the first eight and sat languishing at the bottom of the table, but the last three games, definite upturn in results. Last time out, they beat Sankey Vale 1-0 in the Guardian Cup third round. The game before, they beat Greenalls, Padgates and Oswalds in a local derby 4-2 and prior to that they drew 2-2 with Crewe. They have played each other already this season. Uh, Poynton ran out 2 on winners on the 30th of August. And Poynton are probably the form team in the Cheshire League, only in fact, probably more so, even more so than Whaley Bridge. Um, seven wins on the bounce, 35 goals in the last seven games, absolutely on fire. Last three games, 4-1 against Rudheath Social, 3-1 against Denton Town, and 6-1 against Grappinall Sports in the four times postponed Cheshire Cup third round. They're through to the quarter-finals. Um, at the beginning of January. Match four on Tuesday the 27th sees Greenalls, Padgates and Oswalds take on Nutsford. 12th v 3rd. In fact, the last time they played was the last time out, 17th of December. Nutsford ran out 2-1 winners. Previous two games to that, Greenalls 2-2, Congleton Vale, and lost 2-4 in the local derby against Eagle Sports. Nutsford had a fantastic 8-0 win um, at Garswood, or against Garswood at uh, Manchester Road. And also they beat uh, Broadheath Central from the, our own Cheshire League Division 2. 2-1 two in the County Cup, which sees them through to the quarter-finals in January. Greenalls, Padgates and Oswald against Nutsford. Game 4, Tuesday the 27th.